like 10 men, 10 men, nine dead and one drunk. I am fucked. So here's the setup. I'm heading to Mount Baldy and uh, just getting capped out of the route now. So there's a bike I'm using, so I'm going to TCR. It's a bit cold this morning, got done with some gloves, got the mountain bike shoes on. I've got a sleeping bag in there, got a backpack on just in case. So I'm not sure what to expect at Mount Baldy, uh, 6 18 a.m. We'll have a crack at it, we'll see how we go. It's going to be the tough part, I think, is going to be navigating through LA traffic for the back streets. But it's part of the adventure. Riding through Pasadena, and someone said, Card the fuck up in silver sedan. So, Found a locust tree, a little bit small. Be pretty hungry if you just say, uh, "Good thing I've got some uh, cliff shots, the uh, blocks there, and some cliff bars." I'm, I'm about 3,000 calories today for food to take. That's why I just drink water. Fuck the cigarettes. Fuck the booze. Get on your bike. Hydrate the fuck up. We're at the start of Mount Boulder, there's an intersection there, Strava segment. I'm obviously not going to go full gas because I've got for another 15 hours in the saddle. Um, but I'm just going to just enjoy the view and just keep it under 200 watts and just tap it out. The rest area, secret to climbing, don't stop. Just drop your wattage and enjoy the view. Put in easy gear, drop your wattage, enjoy the view, don't stop. The altitude is suffocating. Just kidding, it's not too hard. It's a nice climb, man. It's pretty easy. It's not very hard at all. Um, as long as you're carved up. It's not a climb you want to bonk on. Run out of carbs or water. It's the start of the chairlifts. That's where the soft people get on. Chairlifts. No chairlifts are doing either. And we're going to go up here. Let's walk it out. That guy down there is going, what the fuck is he doing? So I've just changed my shoes. Left my cycling shoes in my backpack. Smashing into some cliff bars. That's a beautiful view, it's fucking cold as, it probably feels about 7 degrees. This is fucking epic. This is epic. It's getting cold, I'm not sure how long I can keep going for. But, uh, this is hardcore. That's another example, don't ask for people. There's a fucking fire road just along the side here. I walked through the gully of that. Epic. Reaction's at the bottom and this guy goes, yeah, just go straight up that, mate. He didn't have a fucking clue. He, I assumed that he knew. I should have said, hey, buddy, have you ever been to the top of Mount Baldy by bike? That's what I should have asked. So, lesson learnt. It's a fucking good workout, though. It's what I call fucking gravel grinding. Mount Baldy. Fucking A! Fucking A! I'm not sure the TCR is designed for this, but I'm not just the average fucking rider, am I? If you're not riding to ski lifts, 
You're not riding high enough. Mount Baldy. So it's not a high climb, I just got lost. I got sent in the wrong directions. <laughs> I was thinking, man, who the fuck walks up this? This is epic steep. But I understand now there's a fire road people do, so it's not that hard at all. But we'll see how far we can get. We're at 2,000. See that? Two, three, six, seven meters elevation. How much is that in feet? It's a lot. That's the valley down there. It's the other side of uh, This is beautiful, man. There's no one up here, really. There's snow over there. Gravel roads. TCR. Adelaide. Actually, California. Dead quiet. So I've reached snow, looks like a fucking mountain lion. The TCR is going to get some snow time. Wouldn't do that on ice, but... Fuck, this is an epic one, man. It's fucking snow. It's fucking freezing. I don't know, I might have to call this off. If it gets too dangerous, I'm going to have to call it off. Got my fucking lucky map. Oh, it's cold. It's fucking snow. It's fucking snow up here. This is fucking awesome. Can you eat snow? Mm, it's not bad. It's... Tastes less sweet. Clouds are moving in. We're going to be losing visibility soon, maybe. Just creeping over the mountain. Getting engulfed, engulfed by the Mount Baldy cloud. This is the devil's backbone. People die here. This is death defying. We might be losing visibility. I might have to, I might have to not go. Oh man, this is, what do I do? What do I fucking do? I've come so far. You can see what's happening. The cloud's coming over. We've got clarity on this side. We've got, fuck. That could be dangerous. So I'm gonna take it easy. If you fall in there, you're gonna be dying. Devil's backbone. The perils of Mount Baldy. If you fall down that, you go, you're dying, motherfuckers, you're dead. If you fall down there, you're cooked. So far, so good. Just come along here. Be very careful. Devil's backbone. I'm not sure aero bars were meant for this sort of stuff. But this is good fun. I'm not sure the TCR is designed for this, but uh, it's doing all right. We're definitely at altitude here because you can see how puffy this is. Yeah, puffy the the oxygen. I'm, yeah, this is really interesting. I feel like ten men, ten men, nine dead and one drunk. I am fucked. But it's all downhill on the way home. So it can be done. The road bike, people say it's a photoshop, it's not a photoshop mate. That's not fucking photoshop. This is San Antonio Mount Baldy, 10,064 on the giant TCR. Going charging over there. There's a fucking helicopter down there. There's a helicopter coming to save me. They're putting some crazy motherfucker on a road bike up Mount Baldy. Look at him, look at him. <laughs> They're coming to get me. Ranger must be thinking, what the fuck is that dude doing on a motherfucking bicycle on a road bike up Mount Baldy? 
Let me know down below if you've seen anyone come up here. Is this a fucking first? Am I the only dumb fucker that come on a road bike up here? <coughs> 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 a few times I felt like giving up. But I thought I've got to get, I've just got to do it, man. That helicopter's getting blown around, man. That's, that'd be scary. But uh, you just got to do it, mate. Just don't fucking stop. Just keep fucking going. Doesn't matter how slow you're going. That's how you're going to get to the top. Keep eating and drinking and pacing yourself. And, and I got lost and I took this wrong way and I, I just killed my legs. But I, you can't have any excuses, man. You got to have a fucking goal and you want to get to the top. You just got to motherfucking keep going. You just got to keep going. You just got to keep smashing it out. It's fucking cold up here. But I'm glad I made it. Fuck. All the fatigue I just felt in the last fucking nine hours. It's taken me to get here. I've just forgotten it all. Now I'm going to ride back to Santa Monica. Oh, who needs drugs, man? This is, what it's, this is what it's about, man. Just go up fucking epic mountains, do crazy shit. Do shit that people said you can't do. People said you can't bring a fucking bike up the top of Mount Baldy. Well, a couple of people said you could. But a road bike? I don't know, man. Fucking awesome. Thanks for watching. Do you even gravel, bro? This is how we do it, man. Switch back. Switch back. Today, 238 k's, 17 hours 15. So, LA traffic so slow. Traffic light, traffic light, traffic light, traffic light. Um, epic man, 17 hours would do me probably 460 k's in Adelaide, but I had a great day nonetheless. Good training time wise, and so that's why kilometers don't always matter that much because a lot of variation there. But time in the saddle feels solid. I feel like I've ridden 460 k's, found some tape on the side of the road. Good day, you know, you're in a rich suburb because this basketball. Net right on the road. I was gonna know I was gonna trash it, but there you go. Thanks for watching. Got any questions down below? Let us know. Right, today I ate the uh, Cliff Bars fruit juice and uh, Cliff Blocks. How many? Mm, at least two and a half, three thousand calories worth. I don't know. I'm pretty hungry. I'll be hungry. I'll catch up tomorrow. I'll catch up calories tomorrow. Got any questions? It's a bit windy out here. It says up my own Mount Baldy. Let me just go inside for a sec. Not to walk backwards into it. If you've got any questions about anything, let us know down below. Uh, what questions do you want to know about the trip, Mount Baldy, things like that. I'd love to go there again because it's really cool uh, photography. I'd like to take the journey out there. If you've got any questions about Mount Baldy, or if you know anyone else is <laughs> crazy enough to take a road bike up there, let us know down below. Doing it to non versus do it Mount Baldy. Uh, the road section is not that hard. Doing it to is very hard. But I'd say riding from Beverly Hills to Mount Baldy and back was harder than doing to non, especially if you go to the very, very summit of uh, Mount Baldy, the gravel bit. That was pretty, pretty epic. Let us know down below if you have any questions. How do we feel today? Feel really good. Hands are a little bit tight, but they've loosened up now. But legs, no worries.